Some of the main differences between code law and common law systems are set out by Matthias Seems in his textbook, Comparative Law. He groups the main differences into three categories, legal methods and sources, courts and civil procedure, and the form judgments take. In terms of legal methods and sources, the two systems have different origins. Code law or civil law systems trace their origins back to Roman law, which had influenced most legal systems on the continent. In some sense, code law systems are still influenced by the Code of Justinian, the Roman Emperor of the 6th century AD. Common law systems, by contrast, typically don't have any reference points older than the Middle Ages. The role of statute is different in the two systems. In a code law system, statute, or legislation passed by the Parliament, including the different codes, is the exclusive source of general principles. In common law systems, by contrast, statute is important, but you also have to bear in mind past precedent. Because precedent matters in common law systems, courts are regarded as, in part, authors of the law. There's no such creative role in code law systems. Because judges have a creative role in common law systems, academic lawyers tend not to have much influence. In code law systems, it is academics who have that more influential role. They exercise that role by writing commentaries on the different codes and their application. In terms of courts and procedure, common law courts have historically been generalist courts. The law is just the law, and so the High Court can in principle deal with any kind of case. In code law systems, however, the structure of the court system more closely follows the different codes, and so you have separate criminal, civil and administrative courts. Still thinking about code law systems, judges are often recruited straight from university, serving in minor roles, developing a specialisation before moving up the ranks. In common law systems, by contrast, judges, because they're supposed to be generalists, are typically recruited from the ranks of court lawyers. Lawyers play a key role in common law systems, and it's their oral arguments which have a major influence on the thinking of the judge and thus the outcome of the case. In code law systems, by contrast, the process is more of a multi-stage affair, with the judge directing the parties to produce different documents and sifting through them. These differences have consequences for judgments in the two systems. Because judges in a civil law system are supposed to be mechanically applying a code, their judgments are typically quite short and are only supposed to resolve a particular case. In common law systems, judgments can be more individual and can establish precedent. In code law systems, judgments aren't supposed to have these kinds of consequences beyond the immediate legal dispute.